All right, so now uh, Joe's gonna take his shirt off and he's gonna do the exercise shirtless for us at home. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Now we've got our kettlebell goblet squat. So there's a few ways to hold this. Typically what we do is we put our thumbs through the kettlebell and hold like so. Or if it's a little bit heavier, you can go into a bottoms up position which keeps the elbow up and that reinforces your spinal posture. So keeping you tall, basically. If it's lighter, basically all you do is wrap your hands around, grip with your thumbs and hold in a goblet position. And now the aim is again, keep your posture, bend your knees. Big focus here is keeping that knee in line with the second toe, in line with the hip. So as we're going down, basically we just don't want our knee to come on the inside of our foot or inside of our hip. Everything tracks the same. Different to our kettlebell swing, we're trying to maximize the knee bend, load up the quads, not really treating it as a hinge, more of an upright posture as best you can. <laughs> 